while the hope was to have some carnival-related activities staged at the Simon Cultural Center in St. Andrew, this no longer appears likely due to unforeseen delays that have pushed back the project. That's according to Minister for Infrastructure Development, Honorable Norlan Cox. During the government's weekly post-cabinet press briefing on Tuesday, Senator Cox says government is committed to getting the project off the ground, with work to be undertaken by Kenny's Trucking on the 18 million EC dollar project. The Seamoon Cultural Center, which was the base for cultural activities in the parish, was destroyed by Hurricane Ivan in 2004. You would have a pavilion, a multi-story pavilion, uh, which will be constructed. And then you have a, a, a stage area that will be constructed separately. Um, there's going to be a museum uh, that uh, will also house all our cultural and, and sporting um, um, heroes, um, past and current. Um, so they, that is going to be laced with, with pictures and information on them. Uh, there is going to be an area for, for training, uh, uh, dancing, theater, uh, things like that. Uh, uh, part of the design uh, that was included was a, a 25 meter uh, swimming pool. However, that is not included in this scope of works, but for future going forward, um, that was built in, in the initial concept that to have a, a, an area uh, for the big parish to, to, for swimming. Um, but we have not included that as part of this, uh, this scope, but that is something that we are, are looking at. The center will also include commercial spaces for small business activities as agreed on during consultations with residents in the design phase of the project. Senator Cox says the designs were also sent to the diaspora for their input and buy-in. A billboard will be erected showcasing the design concept of the project.